This is the Leophoto SA364CL tripod with the MA30L ball head. So this is kind of the really right stuff, super knockoff of the uh, Anvil 30 ball head. And i um, just going to try to show you how much wobble it has with a few different rifles just to get an idea of how stable it is. Now the only other experience I have shooting off of tripods was with a Manfrotto aluminum tripod with a pig saddle. Uh, so this AR is right around 11 pounds. Walked in there. I'll give it a few taps. So, I don't know. So it definitely has some, a little bit of wobble to it. I've never had any experience with the really right stuff tripods at the same, uh, the similar ones, you know, like the, the old Anvil 30 combo that they have. Um, I'm not a tripod expert by any means, but right now, this is the L model. It has the three largest leg segments deployed. Uh, it's sitting right at about 55 inches from the bottom to the uh, top of the ball head. And uh, it's currently on a vinyl plank floor and it has the stock rubber feet on it. So just to give you an idea, the uh, lever, it's pretty sensitive. When you get around there, you know, you can get some movement and you can let the gun go and it will maintain position. Uh, right around there, that's where you get to the point where it's going to get pretty loose. But that's locked down pretty good. Like I said, that's about how much wobble. I'm sure I could maybe wobble it more. Really don't have too much framework reference though as far as how that's going to compare to the real deal. So that's an 11 pound rifle. I also have this AI. So this is a about 15 pound, 6 ounce rifle. I don't have any Picatinny rails, or I, well, what I'll do is I'll get the AI, uh, the really right stuff AI Arca plate or really right stuff dovetail plate. So really, the only option I have right now to lock it in here. This is this uh, piece of Picatinny that's on this spigot. And, uh, I mean, the ball head, head, ball head itself is pretty strong. I mean, that's, like I said, it's a over 15-pound rifle hanging off the end of that. Definitely got a lot more wobble. But, you know, then again, also not really sitting at its balance point. So not a ton of, uh, not a real, too much of a frame of reference to see how steady the real deal is. But this is about a third the price. I think these go for about 500. If you uh, it's like a coupon code or a, or maybe on eBay make an offer, it's right around 500 chipped. So hopefully that'll give somebody an idea of what you're getting if you order one of these.